Okay, so here we are in Batumi, Georgia. I'm in the uh, Gonio Fortress, which was a, a Roman fortress for several hundred years. Uh, this area was actually, uh, the first settlement is recorded around 700 BC, and then it became a Roman fortress, very significant for this area. Uh, but what's really cool as from a Christian point of view, why it's great to come here and the honor of coming here is because it was the Apostle Matthias. Matthias was one of the 70 sent out by Jesus to take the gospel in Luke chapter 10 when Jesus sent them out in teams, 35 teams, teams of two to go throughout the Decapolis and declare the gospel, preach the gospel, heal the sick, cast out demons, and to prepare the way of the Lord. It was this same Matthias who was then commissioned by Jesus because he took, uh, you know, he was commissioned by Jesus to take the gospel around the world, but he was also chosen by the apostles and the Holy Spirit to take the place of Judas, the one who betrayed Jesus. Tradition says that Matthias is also the one that brought the gospel to the Caucasus area, and we know that, uh, um, that uh, Georgia as a, as a nation came to Christ uh, as a whole, uh, converted to Christianity. I think it was around 300, 301 AD, something like that. So the witness of this apostle after the ascension of Jesus Christ really had great significance and impact on this region of the world. What's really great also from a Christian point of view here, I don't know if you can quite see, by the way, the, the Roman walls that go all the way around here. At one time there were 22 citadels. There's some excavation work going on over here and also over there. Uh, what's really significant about this for a believer's point of view is that Matthias was also brought here and that he was uh, tortured, martyred, and then buried here somewhere on the grounds. And um, so I just pray that whoever watches this would be challenged in their own heart to be a follower of Jesus, to say yes to him, and then don't hide your light under a bushel, but shine it brightly. Don't be ashamed of Jesus. Tell others about him. Be like the apostle Matthias, who is buried some here on these grounds, and uh, at the resurrection, we'll see him in heaven, and we'll hear the rest of the story. Amen.